Hey y'all, how's everybody doing? Well, I hope you're having a good day and I am going to work very quickly in this video. So let me just tell you because right as I started to film, my husband said dinner is served and I'm like, oh, I need to hurry. Okay, so uh, I have, as you saw from the title, a haul. It's a mixed haul because I got my uh, Chanel order in. I got my, um, every few months I um, reorder my soft rose lipstick and some other things. And sometimes I'll get a little treat or two along the way. Or try a new color. Like Y'all remember I tried the, um, <clears throat> the Chic, Ro no, let's see, was it Chic Rosewood? Yeah, Chic Rosewood. And I do like it. Not as well as soft rose. Nothing still, nothing beats soft rose. But then I also had some, um, other items that I got through Ulta, <coughs> excuse me, and I also got some, um, now I know I had something, else. oh, my grocery store haul <laughs> from Sprouts. Sprouts is an all-natural um, grocery store down here in Peachtree City, and um, it's a farmer's market, and I got some items I thought I would share with you. Um, fingernail polish wise, I am not for a loss of fingernail polish. I have so much, it's really like, I could have a nail shop. I thought about that as an age, maybe I'll do people's nails for them. But, um, I am trying to get to using some that are a little more healthy oriented. I still will always love my Chanel, and I don't know, I haven't looked up their ingredients. I don't know if it has things like formaldehyde and toluene in it or not, but if it does, it's not good, y'all. Mm, it's just that buttered caramel, but buttered toffee. It's good coffee. It's good. Okay, I've got little fuzzes on my nose. Okay, so I got the colors I got. I'm like, Beth, this is not even winter colors. But anyway, uh, actually, this color is good for year round. It's called Vintage Pearl. And the brand is, uh, let me look at the name again Mineral Fusion. Let me look on a darker color. Minerals on a mission. <laughs> and um, it's sort of like the one that says um, seven less or no seven. And it's the seven really bad things in nail polishes that they don't have. Um, this one is the same. Again, it's called Mineral Fusion. And it's got this kind of coppery brown lid. But it's just like the Chanel. When you take that off, you have to use that to paint your nails with. But this actually is a year-round creamy color. Let me just hold it back. That is, um, as you can see, I'm needing to do my nails. Um, because it's kind of like a pearlized cream color. And that's what's called vintage pearl. It's not a white pearl. It's a cream pearl. So I got that one. And I also just wanted kind of a, um, I, I actually tried this on in the store and I liked it so much I thought I'm buying this. And generally I won't try one in the, on in the store. They do let you uh, if I don't think I'm going to buy it because I don't want to um, use a product if I'm not buying it. But also they had a tester out so I used the tester. My nails are peeling off as we speak. Okay, this one's called Pink Fire Opal and it is exactly that. Um, because the sheen on the bottle, I hope you can see the color good. Um, it is a kind of a peach melon color. And it is opal. It is like a peach or a, a pink orange opal. And on, it looks really pretty on pale skin. I can just tell you that. You'll see because that's the one I chose to do today. Um, also, I got a glitter top coat just because I think you should always have a glitter top coat handy just in case you need one. So it's just, it's the, um, it's, it's a, it's like a blue, gold, pink, yellow, green. And it's very fine uh, glitters. It's cosmetic glitter. So that's kind of cool. And then I also got another glitter coat. What's wrong with me? I think because when I've got short nails, I feel better about having a uh, glitter coat. Glitter nails. Because when you got really long nails, I mean, it's really noticeable. Did y'all just see when I did that, that my, I need to have my gray covered so bad. Okay. Um, mineral fusion, minerals on a mission, nail lacquers, or anything else I need to tell you. It says, okay, free of formaldehyde, toluene, 
Debutal, Fly Light, and Camphor. Camphor? Like Camphor Vanique? I don't know. Is that bad for you? I need to look up this stuff, y'all. Anyway, it's a pink glitter. Again, it's a very fine glitter. And that would probably be real pretty. Like, I might wear this at the beginning of the week and towards the end of the week put this on. The only thing about putting glitter on top of something is very hard to get off. Oh, my gosh. So, I'll do a light coat. Okay, another thing I got was Pacifica, which is also all these things. If you're in sprouts, you have to be, like, all natural and all that kind of stuff. And it will tell you, like this says, it's 100% vegan, cruelty-free, um formulated without petroleum parabens sls or phthalates i can never say that word and it is cherry matte setting spray so it smells like cherry raspberry leaf and hyaluronic acid it doesn't just smell like that it has that in it because i looked at the ingredients and what was really um interesting is um ingredients the order of the ingredients is is what is the most so what is the most is at the front what is the least is at the bottom and Aqua, obviously, I guess it's water. Glycerin. Um, Vibes Negrum, which is black curant, leaf extract. Rubus Adias, which is raspberry leaf extract. And Okay, I'm not going to read these botanical names. Black curant, raspberry, wild cherry, aloe. These are all leaf extracts. Um, camellia. Seaweed, papaya. And the rest are long words. Um, what I would say about that is, I would imagine that if you have gone to the trouble to advertise what you don't put in here, those long words that I don't know what they are, probably are not damaging. But it's just a nice spray. That's kind of a big flame. I'm not... I'm going to try it. Okay. I was very far away from it. Uh, I don't know when it's this wet if it's flammable or not. Boy, God, I Hold 8 to 10 inches away from your face. Close your eyes and spray downward motion three times to cover your entire face. So you should be spraying this way, which I did not do, which is why I look wet. There. I don't have my makeup completely done right today. And I also let my hair dry before I started styling it. So it was kind of really hard to style and very flat. But it's soft because I didn't use much hairspray. And then I fell asleep and took a nap on the bed, the guest room bed with velvet. All right. So I also got Eco Tools Dry Brush. And what you do is this exfoliates and detoxifies your skin. How does it do that? It's a pretty, um, like, pickled looking wood. The, um, what is that? Is that? Bamboo. No, it's a bamboo handle. What wood is this? It says 100% vegan, handcrafted. Anyway, what you do with this, if I, let me just see, before showering, yes, it's before you get wet. You don't get this, this wet. It is a dry brush. Um, and you're not supposed to use it on irritated or damaged or broken skin because what you do is before you shower, you gently brush using long, oh, it says upward strokes. So you stroke this way, okay, towards your heart. Start with your legs and then your midsection, then your arms, always brushing in an upward motion. After use, rinse and hang out to air dry. So they want you to keep it nice and um, clean. So you're going from the bottom up and you're always going up. And what this does is it does slough off because it's a little uh, rough. Not too bad though. I mean, you can I can feel it through the little hole. And it's, um, the bristles aren't like horribly rough but they're rough enough to slough some skin off and also to get your circulation going and that's what helps detoxify get all that blood flowing all that oxygen flowing and um and it's just good for you so this is great to do before every shower so i got one so there's that okay and then also from ulta i got two things i wanted to try actually i got three because i tried a bare minerals Gin Nude Rose Eyeshadow Palette. And because I ordered that, I got this free sample. And it has in it sunscreen. So it has, um, so what is this? Without, clean without compromise. Skin Longevity Sleeping Gel Cream. I well, if that's eye cream. It doesn't say eye. A seeking, so the name of this is Skin Longevity. 
is the name of Bare Minerals sub brand uh, or collection. And one of them is a Vital Power Infusion and Power Replenish Renew Fortify. Lots of great extracts. Uh, moisturizer. And a gel cream. And unfortunately, it doesn't say what it's for. Now, see, when you advertise all those cool names, but you don't say what to use it for, I think that's a mistake. Okay, so the first one it says use on face and neck, morning and night. Of course, I always want you to do morning and night because you use more. Um, the moisturizer is an SPF 30, so that is definitely a good one to use on face and neck. Only a dime size of this. On the pump one, you only use two pumps. And um, at night, apply a dime size of the sleeping gel cream. So all of these are moisturizer um, based and anti-aging in the sense that they blot the sun's rays. And so it's a nice little size, um, you know, where you could get a couple of uses out of it. Like maybe use half of it and then close this up good and use the other half. Because, I mean, using it once or twice, you're not going to really get the real feel for how it works. But it kind of gives you a feeling for it and see, do I want to, you know, get an order of this. So, that was free, so I will definitely try that. And this is the beautiful palette. Very, very pretty. I'll put it next to my face. So you see, it's a smaller one. Sort of like the Charlotte Tilbury one that I'm uh, doing with the giveaway. I hope you guys have gone over to my um, Beth Buchanan Pure Bible channel and have uh, entered. Remember, you got to subscribe to both channels. You need to like the video over there. You need to say a uh, comment below, trust God no matter what, and then also give the name of someone that you got to subscribe because, of course, we're trying to build subscription. Um, these colors are amazing, y'all. I love them. It says it's nude. I guess it is a little cooler tone. Nude Rose. Gen Nude is the collection name, and Rose is the name of the eyeshadow shadow palette. I don't see anything rose about that. And then, of course, I also got my It Cosmetic no tug gel eyeliner black eyeliner so those are the two things that i got there and then i also did chanel so i'll do that in my next video i'll talk to you again